In the heart of Tanzania, amidst the vast landscapes of the East Africa Rift Zone, stands a mountain unlike any other on Earth, Aldonia Lengay. This is the most unique volcano on our planet by far, as it is the only volcano that releases natron carbonatite lava, a rare form of lava that is significantly different to the silicate-based magma typical of most other volcanoes. Our story begins deep within the Earth, where the geological marvels of the East Africa Rift Zone play out. Here, the Earth's crust is thinning, pulled apart by the relentless forces of tectonic movements. We've already made a video about the East African Rift Zone, and you can find that in the description down below. In this dynamic setting, Goldonio Lengay rises as sentinel over the landscape, a completely different volcanic entity that releases rare carbonate lavas. Scientists are still unsure why this lava is released from Aldonio Lengay, and there are many theories regarding where the melt is derived from. But one thing is clear, this is a completely different volcano from the ones we are used to discussing on this channel. Beneath its surface, a rare alchemy unfolds. Unlike its volcanic brethren that churn out silicate-based magma, Aldonia Lengay releases a form of carbonatite lava. Carbonatite lavas are extremely rare, and Aldonia Lengay is the only volcano to release natron carbonatite. In general, carbonatitic magmas appear to form through the separation of carbon-rich phases from the original magma. Here, the magma is rich in carbonatites, particularly natron carbonatite, a composition so rare it's found nowhere else on Earth. These carbonatites contain a cocktail of minerals like fluorite, sylvite, apatite, galena, and more. Another unique aspect of the lava is the lower temperature that it exists at. Normally, a lower temperature results in a more viscous magma, and we see this occurring in falsic magmas. But in this case, the lava released from Aldonio Lengay is fluidic to the point where it flows like water, and it exists at a temperature of around 600 degrees Celsius or 1,112 degrees Fahrenheit, which is extremely cold compared to other magmas. When Aldonio Lengay erupts, it's a spectacle unlike any other. The lava, with its lower temperatures, flows like a black fluid river, vastly different from the glowing red streams of other volcanoes. As previously mentioned, it's so fluid that it behaves almost like water, albeit with a dark, oily appearance. As this unique lava meets the air, it undergoes a dramatic transformation. Rapidly cooling, it turns from its initial black to a ghostly white, forming a powder-like substance that blankets the landscape in an almost surreal fashion. Whilst Aldonia Lengay does release rare carbonitic lavas, it also releases more common silicic lavas too. The volcano is fueled by two separate magma reservoirs, one of which releases phonolytic magma. This phonolite appears to have a completely separate origin from the other rocks. As you might imagine, the plumbing system of Aldonia Lengay is complex as a result of this. The formation of it stretches back over hundreds of thousands of years, beginning more than 500,000 years ago and evolving through distinct phases. The initial phase, known as Lengay 1, was characterized by the eruption of phonolite lava, contributing significantly to the volcano's present-day structure. This was followed by Lengay Phase 2, marked by the emergence of Nephilinic rocks. The volcano's shape, as we know today, was largely completed about 15,000 years ago, coinciding with significant geological formations in a nearby Olduvai Gorge. Aldonio Lengay experienced several collapses over time, notably between 850 to 135,000 years ago, and again between 50,000 to 10,000 years ago. The oldest known eruptions of its unique natrocarbonatite lava date back to about 1,250 years ago. This rare type of lava has also contributed to geological features in the region, including the formation of the shifting sands in the Olduvai Gorge. The volcano has been persistently active, with records of eruptions dating back to the 1880s. Its activity is characterized by the eruption of both tephra and lava flows, primarily from its northern crater. Notable explosive eruptions occurred in the years 1917, 1940, 1966, 1983, and 1993. The volcano has also undergone significant changes in its crater morphology over time. After a quiet phase, Aldonia Lengay reawakened in 1983, with activity continuing to this day. The 2007 eruption was particularly significant, featuring a large explosive event that formed a new crater and affected the surrounding regions, including disruptions to air travel and impacts on local wildlife and communities. And thus, this is the story of Aldonia Lengay, the most unique volcano on our planet. Thanks for watching.